Um, this one is for the really dedicated. Yeah. If but you want to get an A, you right? You definitely want to get, get an A. a? Tattoo the answers to yourself. Yeah. Yeah. Um, they're permanent. They can't, like, you know, yeah, what the is teacher it, can't be like, yo, what's the teacher going to do? What is the teacher going to do? Kick you out of your class? For what? That's They're discriminating against your life choices. Yeah. You can't. So, um, just keep in mind, though, if you're doing this a lot of times, you're going to run out of space eventually. Yeah, so you want real small. You want to keep it small, but big enough that you can read it. And start with, like, some of the places that, like, um, like, cause if you, if you have a really hard test, then you want to use, like, the, the, the readily available spots, the arms, the hands. If it's, like, a test that you just want to have some stuff, inner thigh, maybe. Yeah. Um, maybe on, like, the belly or something. I don't know. Somewhere where, like, it's not too obvious, but, like, you're saving the good spots for later. True. Uh, and it, uh, it's not cheating, like I said, if it's permanent. Probably won't hurt. No, it won't much. hurt. Probably wouldn't hurt too much. It won't hurt. Right? I mean... Tattoos don't hurt that bad, do they? I don't know. I don't know. You're the one with tattoos. Some of them hurt, some of them didn't. I'm, I'm scared, though. I'm Se- scared to think. Secretly, those tattoos have helped Scott on finals. He just won't tell us what finals they've helped him on. Yeah. That, that, that one, that yeah. one, was it that sincerity, one in the one in, the one for Sadia yeah, was for Greek. The one in Greek? <laughs> the one in Greek. The sincerity one would have helped in my, like, third grade grammar, uh, vocabulary class. Yeah. That I've got an A on, probably. Scott got that tattoo in third grade. Mm-hmm. Little does everyone know. Um, one of my personal favorites. This is, this is a good one. Is, this is yeah. a key component. You got, like, you, you, you got a good groove going. Just stop what you're doing. You got plenty of time, hopefully. Get up. Go to the window. Maybe just take a look. Yeah. You're just staring, thinking about things. Maybe, maybe you have a little writer's block. You know, you're like, oh, I'm writing all of a sudden, oh, I don't know what to say. The blinds, move the blinds out of the way. Just get up. Just gaze. Just walk around the room a little bit. Step by the window. Straight up, just gaze. Gaze outside and just think to yourself. Look at the clouds. Look at those clouds. They're great looking clouds, huh? Don't you think? They're fantastic clouds. Look at that squirrel, man. He, He would know, he would know what to write about. That bird. This is especially good if you're going to do this in the Henry Hudson room. That, that is the best. That is a prime spot to get up from your final and just gaze out the window. I'm thinking of Fontaine in my imagination right now. Low Thomas basement. Um, you're going to have to find a window. You're going to have to go you, upstairs if and leave even, the room. Yeah, you're going to have to leave the room. Yeah, but, leave the room, find a window, gaze outside of it. Um, something that has helped others in the past, meditate using a mantra. For those of you that don't know, a mantra is a series of words you repeat over and over again. They're supposed to bring you to a place of relaxation. Um, you want to scream the words. Yeah. Scream the words. To the mantra. If, you're, if your mantra is in the, in the pooter, then you're just sitting in class going, in the pooter, in the pooter, in the pooter. The, That's it. If a teacher says, be quiet when you're reciting your mantra, you say, this is my religion. Discrimination. Discrimination. You say, I'm taking you to court. Yeah, take him to court. I'll see you in court. That's what you tell him. I'll tell him for you. You tell, you tell, you tell me, I'll tell him. Use the mantra. Um... You know what? You're not by yourself. Yeah, you're not by yourself. You're in a room with fellow scholars. Yes. They, their answers could be just as credible as yours. Take a gander and critique. Yeah, critique. Be like, oh, Read through. I didn't think about that. I'm going to use it. Nice point, Bob. I didn't think... Yeah, I forgot about this one. Oh, good thing I looked at your paper. Uh, you want to look at mine? But also, when you look at theirs, like, I don't like that point, let them know. Be like, this sucks. Yeah, they want to know because it's better you're telling them than the teacher. Yeah. They can fix it still. But also, if they do have a good point... Yeah, if their points are too good... If they're too good... You still want to tell them it sucks so you can steal it. Yeah, you want to kind of sabotage them. You, like, you are a shark. This is all wrong. What are you doing? Oh my god, this is... A yeah, then you're right. You're like, see, you're like rip it up yeah. and take it. You're a shark, and they're just little fishes. You're eating them alive. That's what school's all about. See what school's a fish, yeah. See what that was good. Yeah. You guys, you guys out there wish you could be as smart as we yeah, are. I mean, I things get ugly, you know, the whole, like, that. you know, basically cheating and sabotage yeah. thing. you get up, say nothing, leave. You just leave. You leave. Leave your stuff. People are going to be like, oh, he's coming back. He left his book bags. You're gone. Yeah. You're at McDonald's. Yeah. You're chilling. Another thing you want to do? I like this one. Right. I do this all the time, actually. Mm-hmm. You're taking the test. All of a sudden, just, you know what? Ask the teacher, like, how their weekend was. Just something completely yeah. off guard. Who who's the third baseman for the Diamondbacks? Oh, I'm, I'm, what? We're in Spanish. Well, uh, yep. Yeah, okay. By the way, while you're at it, uh, how about these conjugations? And teacher will give them away. They will probably give them away. They're just in the mindset of, oh, my weekend was great. Oh, wait, that conjugation, yeah, it's you add it. No, it's an O. Looking back, you want to know how much of a joke my high school was? I was in a chemistry class sophomore year, where I could literally take the test up to the teacher. Say I have a question like with an equation, the teacher would literally go through the equation. On the test, and I would like always get one hundreds. 
because I always got the answers just to ask the teachers. And obviously, we're carrying on that great tradition of excellence that I was raised in. College teachers are a little bit smarter than Scott's sophomore chemistry teacher. I but they're like not that so. much smarter. She invented something, some kind of dish. Like a Mexican dish? No, some kind of, like, plate. Like, like, like a, actual plastic. Like China? I think it was called Malamim or something. Like China? Like what you eat on? Fine, China. She was Chinese. Funny story. Again, you know what? Not Won the Nobel out. Prize for some kind of protein. All right, well, you know what? So you're, you're done. You, you're done. The test is done. You probably peaced out. You probably too hard. I'm bailing. First thing you're you done. do, go to the casino, blow all the money. All the money. All the money in the world. You just, blow it. Especially if you're graduating, you are going to make that money right back. Spend it now. You might be dead tomorrow. You might yes. be dead. You could get hit by a bus. You could that casino. There's a reason they're violent. There is. There's totally a reason. Because people die. Yeah. Um, Native Americans they own most casinos. They live there. It's a savage life. See what I did there? Also a pun. God. Oh man, we are good. We I are good today. Yeah. We are on. All right. Can't wait. Yo, uh, let's pop some champagne. Can't wait to submit this for the award show next year. Oh, uh, we're just popping champagne. We finished our finals. We're going to spray people outside. Spray, yeah, hey, lurk by the window. Just spray them. Hey, uh, don't be mad at me. I just finished my final. Spray. Spray them right in the face. Get them in the eyes. Right, right in, in the, the eyes. eyes. Make it hurt. Um, Invest in stocks. This might You might want to do this with your winnings from the casino. Right. Invest in stocks. You're, you're a smart person. You did your final on like a... Uh, I don't know, pottery? Yeah. Do they have pottery in this, in yeah. this crazy school? Um, so you know about stocks. It's time to turn my thing off. Yeah. You know enough about stocks to make a great decision. Uh, uh, oh! Oh! Ah. Scott just got a text from someone special. I did. A little chiquita. <laughs> God, we are so good. Yes! All right, Invest we- in stocks... Um, buy a nice hat. Yeah, you're gonna buy because your head is bald. It's gonna take a while. Yeah, remember that you shaved your head. Well, it's still bald, and you're gonna want to cover that up because it's pretty ugly. But you know what, Scott? I was so worried. If you could just sum up this whole preparation in one phrase, what would it be? See the test, be the test. Can't believe I forgot what it was. See the test, be the test. This is the last time you'll hear this for a while. Oh my god! But. It's probably the most important time. Remember, You're going to see the test. Be the remember, test. know what's on your God. finals. Nails for breakfast. Gorilla breast milk. Yeah, only. Carbo Exclusively. Load. Sneak a beer. Vitamins. Shave the back of your head. Shave it. Shave Take it a study right buddy. Make a study wrap. Wear sunglasses, shirtless sleeves. Tattoo the answers to yourself. Meditate. Stare out the window. Look at other people's answers. Mm-hmm. Tell them they're wrong. Sabotage. Ask teachers questions to catch them off guard. Go to casinos, blow money, pop champagne, invest in stocks, and buy a hat, and you you are, you are a champion. man. You're a man now. Oh, man, I am so excited. Let's Ooh. take a break. We have a great this show. Is our, this, is, this is probably that took the 20... best show ever. That took ever. 25 minutes. You're welcome, world. You know what? Quick preview of what's coming up. We got rants. Rants. We've got some Mad Libs. The exciting conclusion to Maris Fantasy. Yes. The exciting conclusion. Exciting it conclusion. It came down to literally the last day. And it did. And there, a price will be paid. A price is going to be paid. A price will be paid. In blood. Oh my god. You know what? Let's go. Let's go. All right. Here we go. We'll be back.